I did like Hartford Golf Club a lot. I got to hit a lot of drivers and just take advantage of my length. But you had to keep it in the fairway there because I remember there was it was tree line, so you had to keep it in the fairway or you would get blocked and have to pitch out. Just being in that spotlight and just coming up in the final match, you know, it was a huge honor and I was absolutely amazed to be there. 12 years old. At that age, most kids are interested in playing video games, doing sleepovers, and driving their parents insane. However, for this blonde Floridian female golfer, 12 years old meant playing in one of the most prominent sports events, the U.S. Women's Open. Who accomplished this feat? Lexi Thompson. In this video, we will examine Lexi's background, lifestyle, and net worth. Number five, early life, career, and controversy. Lexi Thompson's full name is Alexis Noel Thompson. Lexi was born on February 10th, 1995 in Coral Springs, Florida. Lexi developed a passion for golf from an early age based on the friendly rivalry with her brothers Nicholas and Curtis who are professional golfers. Yes, the trash talk and jokes must have been through the roof. Uh, when I was younger, probably both my older brothers, I always looked up to them, um, just trying to follow in their footsteps. She took her first swing of a golf club when she was just five years old. Thompson was homeschooled and spent many of her formative years traveling and competing. Lexi's parents fully supported her golfing ambitions and felt that school would inhibit her development as a player. In 2003 and 2004, as an eight and nine year old, she showed her talent as a prodigy by winning the US Kids Golf World Championship. Thompson's amateur career began when she burst onto the golf scene and became a household name when she qualified for the 2007 United States Women's Open. At the time, Lexi became the youngest golfer to qualify for the major event until it was surpassed by Lucy Lee in 2014. Lexi failed to make the cut at the event, but the seeds were planted that this young girl was somewhat on the rise and one for the world to watch. Thompson rebounded quickly in 2007 by winning the Aldila Junior Classic and the Westfield Junior PGA Championship. In the process, she became the second youngest winner in American Junior Golf Association and the youngest winner in Junior PGA Championship history. In 2008, she repeated the feat in qualifying for the US Open, but in the 2009 event, she finally made the cut and finished 34th. Lexi showed further progress by finishing 10th in the 2010 edition of the US Open. Thompson still lacked official status as an LPGA Tour member and had to rely on sponsor's exemption to gain entry into tournaments. She finished tied for second at the Avion Masters, which led her to rise 75 places to number 74 in the Women's World Golf Rankings. In February 2011, Thompson tried to play overseas in Australia and struggled in the Women's Australian Open and the ANZ Ladies Masters. Like the fighter, she bounced back to win the one-round Fusion Tour event at her home course in Coral Springs, Florida. Tied after 18 holes, Lexi beat Brett Bergenson on the second playoff hole for her first professional win. In September 2011, Thompson won her first LPGA tournament, the Navistar LPGA Classic, by a five-stroke margin. In the process, she became the youngest winner ever on the LPGA Tour at 16 years old. After winning the Navistar LPGA Classic, Thompson withdrew from qualifying school and petitioned the LPGA for membership based on her win. The petition was approved on September 30th, 2011, and Thompson became a member of the tour for 2012. In 2014, Lexi's career soared to new heights in capturing her first major championship at the 2014 Kraft Nabisco Championship. The victory made her the second youngest women's major winner at the time. Just take us through that day. What was that day like for you becoming a major champion for the first time? Well, it was an amazing day. Starting off with a birdie definitely helped, but um, you know, just hitting that first tee shot, obviously a little nervous, but it was definitely what I've been practicing for what I live for to play under by 2016 Thompson racked up six LPGA tour wins after winning the Honda LPGA Thailand one controversy in Lexi's career was in 2017 during the third round of the 2017 ANA inspiration Thompson was penalized four strokes for replacing her ball incorrectly on the green while playing the 17th hole interestingly the infringement was actually reported by a TV viewer oops the penalty pushed her into a playoff that she lost to So Young Yu. Hey, we're not perfect. You know, it's great to have the fan base that I do, and they really, they got me through the whole round, and, um, you know, it's unfortunate what happened. I did not mean that at all. I didn't realize I did that, and um, I fought strong through the finish, and, you know, it was, it was great to see the fans behind me. 
In 2022, Lexi Thompson is ranked 11th in the world rankings, has captured 11 LPGA wins on tour, but has failed to increase her major championship talent. In 2021, she has her closest finish at the U.S. Open, and in the final round, Thompson led by five strokes on the front nine. However, she shot a five over par 41 on the back nine and missed out on a playoff by one stroke. Despite the heartbreak and only 27, we are confident that Lexi Thompson will climb to the top and capture other major titles. Fun fact. Although Lexi was homeschooled, she still maintained a social life and wanted to attend one of her friends' prom. The problem, she was intimidating to teenage boys being a pro golfer and at least 5 foot 11. So she took matters into her own hands by starting a Facebook contest with the help of her sponsors to find a prom date. The winner would get an all expense paid trip to Florida to be her date. The lucky winner was 20 year old Marine Lance Corporal Mark Scott of Naperville, Illinois, who had received a Purple Heart in Afghanistan. With TV crews from E! following them, it was no ordinary date, but who cares? Number four, earnings, endorsements, and net worth. Lexi Thompson has been rewarded for her hard work and perseverance in the pursuit of her golf career. According to LPGA.com, Lexi Thompson has earned over $11.9 million and is ranked number 14th overall on the career money list. As one of the most successful female golfers on the current scene, Lexi Thompson has gained attention from major brands. She has several brands lining up for her and has signed many multi-year deals with them. One of her long-term sponsors is with the famous brand Cobra Puma Golf. After turning pro, she initially signed a five-year contract and renewed the deal with the brand, which provides her with golf equipment, footwear, and apparel. Lexi also has a clothing line with Puma. Another long-term partnership is with energy drink Red Bull. The company featured Lexi back on a limited edition can. Thompson also has ties with Bridgestone Golf to promote their high-performance golf balls. Recent additions to her portfolio include a deal with Rocket Mortgage, and she wears the company logo on her left sleeve during tour play. According to ExactNetWorth.com, Lexi Thompson's net worth is estimated to be around $3 million. As the third highest ranked female American golfer and entering her prime, Lexi is poised to earn more mega endorsements and golf earnings. Sweet prospects for a sweet lady. Number three, insane fitness, body image, and self-care. Lexi Thompson is a fitness junkie. She spends a lot of time in the gym working out and keeping herself in shape for her sport. She regularly shares pictures of herself at the gym and has shared her workout tips in publications in the past. In an interview with CNN, Thompson said, I'm definitely addicted to the whole training part of it. I love working out. It's kind of like my outlet, just run. Lexi's workout is focused on building strength in the glutes and posterior chain, which makes sense because the glutes are the engine of your golf swing. She starts off her workout with squats using a kettlebell. Then she performs 10 single leg deadlifts per side and moves to a hip rotation using a band to improve balance. The workout is complete with the monster walk. It involves having the band just above her knees and maintaining a good squat position. However, in October 2018, Thompson shared that she was struggling with some major body image issues in an honest Instagram post. In the post, she wrote that she had started doing brutal workouts twice a day, even though she wasn't eating much so that she could lose weight. She said she would compare herself to models on Instagram and tear herself down for what she didn't have. The message ended on an inspiring note with Thompson adding, but what I want to share is that you're not alone in any of your struggles. In the same year, Lexi withdrew from the Women's British Open in 2018 and took a month-long leave from the LPGA. In an Instagram post, she explained, I have not truly felt like myself for quite some time. Thompson wrote on Instagram, I am therefore taking this time to recharge my mental batteries and to focus on myself away from the game of professional golf. Good. As they say, self-care is the best care. Number two, role model and dog lover. Lexi Thompson embraces the role of a role model for young girls. Lexi does everything she can to set a good example. In an interview with Indy Star, she talked about the importance of loving yourself for who you are, saying, I guess I consider myself a role model just because a lot of people tell me I am. But it's not something she's unhappy with. She added, as athletes, we should leave our sport better than when we started. Yeah, Lexi knows her place in society, and unlike many who shy away, she owns it. During her brief hiatus from golf, 
Thompson focused on doing things that made her happy, being true to herself, and improving her mental health. One way she did this was by getting a puppy. She went to the Heavenly Puppies Pet Store in South Florida, where she wanted to go volunteer to walk the dogs to get an escape. Instead of volunteering, she decided to get a dog. She named the dog Leo, and when she returned to golf, she had him by her side. Thompson regularly posts adorable Instagram photos with the pup. How cute. Number one, cars, mansion, and personal life. Back in 2017, Thompson received a $1 million bonus because of winning two events on the LPGA Tour. How did she spend it? By buying a souped up car. The car was a Nissan GTR and it has a starting cost of around $110,000. In 2015, Lexi announced a partnership with Lexus USA with a nifty red Lexus. And later in 2020, she was pictured with a Bentley Continental after switching sponsorships. Damn, sponsorship does have its perks. In 2015, Lexi purchased a fully furnished model home in Delray Beach, Florida, and moved into it by the spring of 2016 when she turned 21. It was like love at first sight when she walked into the house. It was an ideal location to golf in Florida and close to her sibling and parents to keep in touch. In terms of her personal life, Lexi prefers to keep details under wraps. She has been in the limelight for more than a decade and still there is no information about her love life. It is not clear if she is single or married. She seems to be focused on her career at the moment. So the beautiful Floridian blonde has won on and off the golf course through mega endorsements, her focus on fitness, self-care, and being a role model for young girls. Lexi is indeed enjoying life. Do you think Lexi will eventually become the highest ranked American female golfer in the world? Do you think she can win a second major in 2022? Let me know in the comment section, smash the like button, and subscribe to the channel for premium sports-related content. Until next time.